Hi, I'm Sam, and I am um, going to teach you how to get NES and all the and most of the NES ROMs on your iPhone or iPod Touch if it's 1.1.3 or 1.1.4. I'm going to be doing it on the iPhone, so I'm going to scroll across. I'm going to go to Installer first of all to start it off. Go load. See Installer. You're going to go down. You're going to hit Sources. You scroll down. You're going to make sure you have Big Boss Apps in Community Sources, which should be locked. If you don't, you should download Community Sources. So you're going to go to Sources. You're going to go to Edit. You go to Add. You're going to type in 1, 2, 3, Locker. dot com or one two yeah one two three locker dot com you can click OK I've already installed this so I'm just gonna click cancel click done then you're gonna go to install you go down to games and you're going to go down to the NES, click install, install, just take, just install pretty fast, it's, five, it's, half a, it's half a megabyte, then you're going to go to the home screen, you're going to go See, there's my NES. There. I'm gonna keep going across. I'm gonna go to Installer. Gonna go to Install. Go back down to Games. Going to go to. Down to. Uh, uh, and gonna go to N. See, NES ROMs can be about 5.9 megabytes, depending on, it's going to come up saying that this is an untrusted source, so download it anyways. Depending on how fast your internet is, it could take, that's depend, that, that'll be how long it'll take to download. I have pretty fast internet, so it's going to download pretty quickly. So as this downloads, you're going to get most of the NES ROMs, such as Donkey Kong, Super Mario, Bomberman, a whole bunch of those. Um, what else? That Yeah, that'll be pretty much most of your ROMs. It, well, there's going to be like a bunch of different ROMs, all different games. You'll get Zelda. I think there's a bunch. I'll show you them in a minute once it downloads. So just keep, it, it'll download. Taking an abnormally long time. It okay, it'll come up with a notice saying something about confirmed to work with 1.1.3 and 1.1.4, as well as 1.1.2 and 1.1.3. This only works with 1.1.3 iPod Touch. So this works with every iPhone and only 1.1.3 on the iPod Touch. So for you people that are using the iPod Touch, um, that's not 1.1.3 or higher, I wouldn't use this. So then you're going to go back to your home screen. You know, in my case, I'm going to type in my password. I'm going to scroll across to Ness. I have a whole... All these are Ness ROMs. Alright, thanks. I'll be back with more Ness, Game Boy Advance, and all the other systems. Thanks for watching.